Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back for more. Let's play Legend of Zelda Oracle of Ages. In the last part, we beat the uh, third dungeon, and we got the um, next uh, Essence of Time. So, next, uh, we're going to... I know that I said that I'm going to try to upload a part every two days or something like that, but... Um, this one's probably going to be a while because there's three separate things you can do. I'll talk about that when I get to it. But uh, there's going to be three separate things that we can do later. So uh, this part's going to be uploaded and then I'm going to have the choices of something that you can choose from depending on um, what I'm going to talk about when we get there. But anyway, after you beat the Moonlight Dungeon, go ahead and walk down here and walk around here. And go up here. When you come up here... You'll see this Takei and these two Takeis and some red creature there. These shoes fish washed ashore. It looks fresh and tasty. Red fish has a very exciting flavor. Dee Dee. Go ahead and talk to this one. We found this red fish. We're dying to savor its exciting flavor. Hey, what are those red seeds you have? Ember seeds? What an exciting name. Will you trade ember seeds for our fish? Sure, why not? It's a deal. I can't wait to taste it. Crack, munch, munch. Hot, hot! It burned their mouths, huh? So go ahead and speak to this red creature. I was almost eaten. I'm Dimitri. I can swim in the sea. Are you going? So are you going somewhere? I give you a. R I can give you a ride. I chomp when you press A. I swim like a fish, even up waterfalls. You can even carry me using the power bracelet. So yes, this is a Dodongo, if you can't couldn't tell. So anyway, go ahead and get on him. And here we need to go ahead and go up here. And go this way three times. And he's going to be one of the things that will be important depending on what uh, thing you take. Just a little hint there. But you can go ahead and have him eat the bushes if you would like. Go ahead and get off of him. And plant a gosh seed right here. Plant it. Alright. Let's go ahead and hop back on him. And then after we do that. Go ahead and go up here. This time we have to go left four screens. So go ahead and do that. So, yeah, I like Dodongos. They're probably one of my favorite creatures in the Zelda universe. Whether enemies or not, I kind of like Dodongos. So they're probably my favorite enemy. We're here. You go along now. Bye. Alright, so after we do that, let's go ahead and go up here. And let's enter this cave. Alright, so first thing you actually want to do is go ahead and go up here. And you want to shoot one of your seeds this way. There we go. To create that bridge. Alright, go ahead and go over here. And next thing we want to do is go ahead and chop down Tingle. Uh, like we did previously when we had the kangaroo. And talk to him. What's this? Well, look at all the mystical seeds you've gathered. Tingle the fairy can make it so your satchel can carry more seeds. Shall I? Sure, why not? Very well. Then Tingle shall work his magic. Close your eyes. Tingle, tingle, kalu, limpa. Your seed satchel can now carry more seeds. Alright, so that was helpful. So go ahead and go down here. And let's get out of here. Alright, so after that, we want to go ahead and go down here. And we want to go this way. And then go up three times. Three screens. Uh, go ahead and lift this out of the way. So, go ahead and do it up here. And if you want to, you can chop those ember seeds down to get more. And go to here. Alright, so this is where I want to talk about it. Um, if you remember the three animals, we had uh, the um, flying bear, I forgot his name. And we had Ricky the kangaroo, and we just had uh, Dimitri the Dodongo. So, in the next area, we're going to um, be able to choose one of those three. And then there will be... Um, a choice that you can uh, make so but go ahead and watch the ending of this because there are some things that um, will 
be able to get whether depend you know it then it doesn't matter which one of these three you choose so there are going to be some things no matter which one you choose we'll be able to do so go ahead and watch the end of, of this one and then at the ending i'll put the uh three choices i'll link the videos depending on which one you choose so basically this is either if you want to spend rupees or depending on which uh, creature you like better oh yeah that was that was right that was Mucha the flying bear I think his name was that we the first animal we saw but anyway uh, first thing if you want to choose Dimitri what you want to do is go ahead and go into the shop and you can buy this flute right here it's a strange flute uh, later when we do something it'll change and be called Dimitri's flute but when you pick it up it will just be called a strange flute no I don't want to buy it now but just remember that if uh, you want Dimitri, go ahead and buy that. If not, I'll show you how to get the um, next flute. So, I'm not going to get either one now, but I'm going to show all three of the uh, ones. So, I'll be making separate save states, of course, to show those all off when we get there. <coughs> and I'll talk about it when we get to that location. But anyway, what you want to do is go ahead and walk up here to uh, the Meku Trees area and go this way. Okay, so when you get here, go ahead and play your Harp of Ages. And go into it. Alright, so what you want to go ahead and do is go down here. Um, yeah. Right? Yeah. So... And we want to go this way. And I believe we want to go ahead and go down one more. Yes. And what you can do here is in this place, you can pay 10 rupees to play a uh, mini game. I'll, and that'll get you uh, Bricky's flute, Bricky the kangaroo. I'll show that one when um, I do the part. I'll go ahead and show it and then I'll cut to the area after that. But. Right now I'm not going to show it, I'm just showing this is where you play the game, you pay 10 rupees to play it each time. So anyway, go ahead and leave. I'm going to go ahead and leave. But the next parts you can do, and also for uh, the Flying Bear, Mucho, or whatever his name is, you don't get any flute, you just go to the area, so you don't have to waste any rupees if you don't want to. But if you like the other ones, better you can do those. But anyway, um, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. And, uh, like I said, the next areas, uh, next things we can do, it doesn't matter which one you choose, uh, you can go ahead and do it, but, anyway. Like I said, at the end of this, I'll make a, uh, special video showing, uh, where you get to choose which one you wanted. But anyway, let's go ahead and go this way three times. And after we go over here. I'm going to go ahead and go down two screens. And we want to go this way two screens again. And go ahead and kill enemies when you can. Ow. And go ahead and go down again, I believe. Yes. And we'll enter the uh, forest with the, f the fairies forest, I think it's called again. So. Anyway, after you get into the fairies forest, go ahead and go, uh, not get blocked by the trees. Go ahead and go these ways, this way. And kill off the enemies. Come here, there we go. Alright, so go ahead, and after that, go ahead and go down. And then, left. Down. Right. Then I believe, ow, up. Uh, okay, and after that we can go ahead and uh, hop across here to get 50 rupees. Yay! Alright, so after that go ahead and hop up here. And after that we want to go ahead and go up, left, up, and right. Alright, so after that let's go ahead and climb up these stairs. And go up the screen, and then go this way, and go into here. 
Alright, go ahead and talk to this guy. I'm so hungry, my stomach hurts. Ah, I'm hungry. Pardon me, I just thought you could help. Ah, I'm hungry. Give him tasty meat? Sure, why not? Yes. Ha, ah, meat. What's this? Hand it over. Food at last. Chomp, chomp. What did, why are you staring at me? Oh, you want something? How greedy. How mean. You won't leave until you get something. Fine, you can have this. Ha, meat. You got a doggy mask. A dog lover will love it. Alright, so... After that, go ahead and exit. And next thing we want to do is go ahead and go right. And then go down. And then we want to go right twice. So go ahead and kill this guy here. And go right again. Alright, after that, go ahead and head to this house. And speak to this lady right here. I'm Mama Muyan, the top breeder in town. My dog is much cuter than that dog, much cuter. But my dog is very shy. Well, that mask. It fits my dog perfectly. Let me have that mask. Give her the doggy mask? Sure, why not? Good boy, you deserve the toy that my dog played with. You got a dumbbell, but there's only one. What's wrong, boy? I only have one to begin with. Okay, if you say so. But anyway, let's go ahead and go down. Alright, so now we're almost done with this. So go ahead and go this way. And... Climb the stairs again. And what you want to do is go ahead and shoot one of your... Uh, things out of your seed shooter here. To burn that tree and then shoot another one. That will make the bridge appear. So go ahead and go here. And then go up. Alright, so... Oh, well, hold on. When you get up here, uh, she may come by again. But... Oh, fudge. So go ahead. <laughs> oh. Oh, shoot. Dang it. I didn't see that one. I blended in. But anyway, <laughs> this is where the part I'm going to be making the um, video are the um, parts right now. I'm going to put the links to the next parts depending on what animal you chose. So I'm going to put that right now. And you can go ahead and click on whichever one you want depending on which animal you decided. And the next time we will uh, be doing, I will be showing those three parts. So until next time, thank you for watching everybody and have a great day.